Welcome to the world of Degrassi High, where teenage drama unfolds in all its raw and relatable glory. This 1987 TV series captures the essence of high school life without any unnecessary glamour or melodrama. No fancy words, just real stories about real teens navigating through the highs and lows of adolescence. But here's the hook buckle up, because the show has a roller coaster of funny, shocking, and downright sad facts coming your way. Wondering if there's a particular scene that left a lasting impression on you? Or maybe you have a personal story of how this series has influenced or shaped your life. Stick around, because we've got more to uncover. Have you ever found yourself reflecting on your most memorable experience related to the series? We want to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Share the laughter, the tears, and everything in between. So, whether you're a longtime fan or a newcomer, keep watching because Degrassi High is more than just a show. It's a journey through the ups and downs of adolescence that resonates with us all. Step into the world of Degrassi High, a classic TV series that paints a genuine picture of high school life in 1987. No glamour, no exaggerated drama, just the real, relatable experiences of teenagers navigating the ups and downs of adolescence. Imagine a show that tells a compelling story through the varied experiences of teenage life, bringing a mix of emotions that will make you both laugh and think. This series shows the lasting impact of real stories told without embellishments. It's not just about the highs and lows, it's about the many aspects of being a teenager. Degrassi High captures the essence of those awkward moments, the mix of laughter, and the heartbreaking tears that come with the journey from adolescence to adulthood. Set against the late 80s, Degrassi High doesn't just entertain, it resonates. Whether you're a longtime fan or new to the show, the characters and plot lines invite you to reflect on your own experiences. Have you ever found yourself reminiscing about a scene that mirrored your own life? Share those moments in the comments below. As we explore the world of Degrassi High, it becomes clear that the series goes beyond generations. It's more than just a show. It's a relatable mirror reflecting the universal struggles of growing up. So, join the journey through the world of teenagehood, where laughter, tears, and everything in between unfold in a compelling story. What's your personal connection to Degrassi High? Share your stories and memories, and let's celebrate the lasting impact of a series that has left a lasting impression on its viewers. Keep watching, because in the world of Degrassi High, the journey is as compelling as the destination. Transport yourself back to the 1950s, a crucial era that set the stage for the cultural and historical context of the 1987 TV series Degrassi High. The 50s marked a post-war period characterized by significant social and political changes, with the Cold War emerging, the civil rights movement gaining momentum, and suburban culture taking shape. In the cultural realm, the 1950s witnessed the birth of rock and roll, a music revolution challenging traditional norms. This era also saw the rise of television as a primary source of entertainment and information shaping the perspectives of a generation. The ideal of the nuclear family gained prominence, emphasizing stability and conformity. The historical and cultural nuances of the 1950s play a crucial role in understanding the themes and content of Degrassi High. The show captures the essence of a time when societal expectations were undergoing a metamorphosis. It delves into the intricacies of teenage life against a backdrop of shifting norms, exploring the challenges and triumphs of adolescence within the context of a rapidly changing world. The series draws on the echoes of the 50s, weaving a narrative that reflects the tensions and aspirations of that era. The exploration of relationships, identity, and societal expectations in Degrassi High resonates with the seismic cultural shifts of the 1950s. The characters grapple with the evolving landscape, mirroring the challenges faced by teenagers navigating the complexities of a society in transition. The 1987 TV series becomes a mirror reflecting the universal struggles of growing up, transcending generations. It not only entertains, but also invites viewers to reflect on their own experiences, creating a timeless connection between the past and the present. The echoes of the 1950s in the show's themes and content add depth and resonance, making it a compelling journey through the timeless challenges of adolescence. In essence, the cultural and historical backdrop of the 1950s serves as a significant influence on how the series unfolds its narrative. It captures the essence of a bygone era, infusing the timeless struggles of teenagehood with the echoes of societal shifts, creating a story that resonates across generations. 
Joey, a character in the series, grapples with dysgraphia, shedding light on the challenges faced by teenagers with learning differences. This adds authenticity to the portrayal of high school life, showcasing the diverse experiences of adolescents. Interestingly, the show goes beyond its on-screen cast, with crew members making cameo appearances. For instance, the art director, Judy Shiner, appears as a customer at Spike's mom's salon, and the picture editor, Robert DeLint, takes on the role of a cashier. Even Susan Nielsen, a writer for the series, steps in front of the camera as Lawella, the caretaker of Degrassi Junior High. This blending of roles adds a unique dimension to the series, blurring the lines between those behind the scenes and the characters they bring to life. Digging into the administrative side, we learn that Mr. Radich's first name is Daniel, mirroring the name of the actor who portrays him, Dan Woods. This small but interesting detail adds a touch of realism to the character, providing viewers with a more personal connection to the school's stern figurehead. In essence, the show not only explores the lives of its characters, but also integrates the real-world experiences of its creators into the narrative. It shows the commitment to authenticity and its ability to connect with a broad audience going beyond the boundaries between fiction and reality. Sue Johansson, renowned for hosting the Sunday Night Sex Show, lent her voice to Dr. Sally in the episode Great Expectations. A sex expert akin to her real-world persona, Dr. Johansson's influence extended beyond voice acting as she made an on-screen appearance in The Whole Truth. This collaboration continued into Degrassi, The Next Generation, with Dr. Sally reappearing in episodes like The Mating Game and Careless Whisper. Degrassi Junior High's Grade 9 welcomed almost everyone, except Joey, whose devotion to his band overshadow with academic pursuits. This unique twist in the high school narrative shed light on the diverse paths teens navigate during this pivotal phase of their lives. In the inaugural episode Kiss Me, Steph, a minor blip occurred when Imis, Avery mistakenly referred to one of the twins, later identified as Heather and Erica as Stacy during attendance. This subtle yet amusing oversight added a touch of realism to the classroom setting. Joey's portrayal in the series touched on the topic of dysgraphia, highlighting the challenges faced by students with learning differences. This nuanced exploration contributed to the authenticity of the show's representation of high school life. Beyond the cast, crew members made unexpected cameos, blurring the lines between those behind the scenes and the characters they brought to life. Art director Judy Shiner, picture editor Robert DeLent, and writer Susan Nielsen all made on-screen appearances, adding a layer of authenticity to the series. Digging into administrative details, Mr. Radich's first name, Daniel, mirrored the actor portraying him, Dan Woods. This subtle connection between the character and the actor added a personal touch to the stern figurehead of Degrassi High. In essence, Degrassi High's commitment to authenticity shines through in its exploration of real-world issues, be it learning differences or the seamless integration of crew members into the on-screen narrative. The series remains a compelling mirror reflecting the challenges and triumphs of adolescence transcending generations.